Stillwater with 11.34 left to play in the first quarter. Number eight, Oklahoma State and Baylor are scoreless. The Cowboys just had a long punt return for a touchdown by Des Bryant wiped off the board due to penalty. But they still have excellent field position, first and 10 from the Baylor 46. And Brandon Pettigrew in a tight end on the right side. As Robinson under center takes a snap, hands it off to Hunter. Right side, 45, breaks a tackle at the 41, and is dropped at the Baylor 39-yard line, a gain of seven yards. It'll be second down and three. The outstanding middle linebacker, Joe Pavelic, made the stop for Baylor. Let's go down to Robert Allen. Welcome back, Brandon Pettigrew. He took his man seven yards on the block, guys. Drove him back. First game he's played in a month. Now Pettigrew shifts over to the right side of the formation. And Zach Robinson is in the shotgun on second down and three from the Baylor 40. Zach takes a snap, fakes a handoff, swings it out, left flat, caught by Bryant. Blocker in front, 35, left sideline 30, and smacked down hard at the Baylor 28. Gain of 12 yards before free safety Jordan Lake made the tackle. First down, Oklahoma State. Well, he's the big hitter in the Baylor secondary, too. There's no doubt about that. We talked about Zach Robinson remembering the hit he took from Jordan Lake last year in Waco. Des Bryant is out of the game, and Josh Cooper lined up right, and Robinson throws it to Cooper right side, makes a catch at the 24, and is tackled immediately after a four-yard gain. And Terrius Bryan, the corner, made the stop. John, they've been concerned about how many plays Des Bryant is playing in a game, and since he's involved in the special teams, they're trying to get Josh Cooper out there a little bit to give Des a break, and so Cooper now lines up to the left with Demarcus Conner. You have an eye formation with Bryant Ward, the Stillwater native at fullback, and Kendall Hunter, the tailback, on second and six from the Baylor 24. We're scoreless, 10-18 left in the first. Robinson runs the option left, hits it to Hunter, he fumbles it, and Baylor recovers it. It bounced on the turf and into the awaiting hands of the inside linebacker, Jeremy Williams. And the Cowboys turn the ball over. Looked like Hunter took his eye off of it, John. Well, the pitch, it's up a little bit, but yeah, it looks like Kendall may be looking downfield a little bit or looking at the hole. It just bounced right off of him and then popped straight up in the air. Well, the Cowboy offense has had a three plays and out offensive possession. And now they've fumbled the football. And Baylor takes over first to 10 from its own 35. Split backs. Griffin in the shotgun takes a snap. Hands it off to Finley up the middle. He smacked at the line of scrimmage and maybe got a yard up to the 36. Seth Clements, Patrick Levine, both in there. Yeah, Clements the first one to get a hand on him. Clements in the game at middle linebacker as Ori Lemon is taking a break. Now the Cowboys go to three down linemen and five defensive backs, two linebackers. Second down and nine, Baylor from its own 36, and Griffin takes a snap, runs around right end, and he smacked hard out of bounds. After a short gain up to the 38 by Andre Sexton, the reigning Big 12 Conference Defensive Player of the Week, and Baylor faces a third down and we'll say seven from the Bear 38-yard line as we are scoreless. Nine and a half minutes left in the first. Well, he's quick, but you also get an idea of just how good the Cowboys have been side to side by the way they closed on him on that play. Three receivers left and two to the right. Baylor is 0 for 2 on third downs. Third down and a short seven for the Bears from the Baylor 38. Griffin in the shotgun, gets the snap, sets up, throws over the middle, it's caught. In Cowboy territory to the 45, and Kendall Wright ankle tackled at the 43-yard line of Oklahoma State by Andre Sexton. Another one of those speedsters in the Baylor receiving core making that catch. Nice gain on the play of 19 yards and a Baylor first down from the Cowboy 43. Now Griffin, alone in the shotgun on first and 10, takes a snap, blitz coming, has time, dumps it off short over the middle, caught by Geddes to the 35, veers off to the left sideline, and steps out of bounds near a first down at the Oklahoma State 32 as Parrish Cox ran him out of bounds. Cowboys brought pressure, extra pressure from the right side that time. Ricky Price trying to blitz, but he was taken care of pretty easily, and Griffin had time. Two receivers to each side. Griffin in the shotgun on first and 10, takes a snap, swings it out to Finley, right side, and he is dropped! Dropped for a seven-yard loss back at the 39-yard line by junior college transfer defensive end Jeremiah Price, who Tim Beckman told us yesterday, the Cowboy defensive coordinator, a guy who's really coming on, John. Well, that's a great read by Price. 
He doesn't even try to come up the field. He reads Griffin and sees where the ball's going. Second and 17 for Baylor from the Cowboy 39. We're scoreless with eight and a half minutes left to play in the first. Five defensive backs, three down linemen for the Cowboys as Griffin takes the shotgun snap. Sets up, pumps, now he's scrambling, throws over the middle and it's caught at the 20 and dropped at the 16 yard line. Jay Finley stumbles down after a big gain on the play of 24 yards and a Baylor first down from the Cowboys 16. It's a play made by Griffin right there. That's, that's where the ability to do first, he's got time, then he gets away and just finds the open spot. Baylor has been 10 out of 10, perfect in the red zone the last three games. They're in there now on first and 10, and it's a handoff and up the middle to the 10, and bullying his way down to the six yard line. Jacoby Jones, the fullback. Baylor's move from its own 35 down to this point, and Griffin runs the option right. Pitches it to Finley, trying to turn a corner right side to the five, and he runs. Did he get into the end zone? They're saying Maya stepped out of bounds at the one. He did. He went around Dory Lemon, who tried to come up and make the play. Gain of five. It'll be first and goal for Baylor. Uh, it's good hustle by Ori. But he was the only one out there on the edge. Cowboys did a good job of forcing Griffin to let go of the ball, but no one else out there except for Ori. Single wide receiver is Justin Akers to the left. Three receivers right, one back set. Jay Finley behind Griffin. They run the quarterback sneak straight ahead. He didn't get in. He, in fact, he got nowhere. I don't even think he gained an inch. It'll be second and goal from the one. Straight ahead. This is a veteran Baylor offensive line, John, that has a combined 100 career starts. Tim Beckman told us yesterday that they're probably as good an offensive line as the Cowboy defense has faced this year. Offset eye. Jacoby Jones now the tailback. Griffin under center. Second and goal. Hand off to Jones. Right side. Hit at the line of scrimmage. And he pushes the ball over the pile into the end zone for the Baylor touchdown. They got an initial stop with the 225 pounder, but his second effort and simply a reach out over the edge of the goal line puts Baylor on the board first. And Ben Parks will be in to attempt the extra point for the Bears. Snap back, ball down, kick on the way, and it's blocked. There was a huge surge up the middle, and Derek Burton is a guy that got it. There were about three guys in the vicinity of that kick, and the Cowboys blocked the point after. Had they not blocked it, it would have been amazing. There were guys all over that thing. 6.25 left in the first, timeout on the field. Baylor has an early 6-0 lead over number eight, Oklahoma State. Baylor in the special teams up to this point. Zach Robinson in the shotgun on first and 10. Kendall Hunter is lined up to his right. The Cowboys fumbled on their last possession. And Zach takes a snap. Hands it off to Hunter up the middle and nowhere to go. Only a one yard gain up to the 40. Antonio Johnson made the stop for Baylor. It'll be second down and nine for Oklahoma State. Baylor six, Oklahoma State nothing with 6.05 left in the first. Forced up inside there. Nicely done defensively by Antonio Johnson, who made Kendall Hunter cut back to his left. Where there were more white jerseys. Two receivers left, one right. Kendall Hunter in a one-back set to Zach's right. The Cowboys with a second down and nine from their own 40. This is a veteran Baylor defense. They have five three-year starters on their main line. And Zach hands it off to Hunter. Bounces it outside to the left to the 44, and he's dropped at the 45 of Oklahoma State. Zach takes a snap. Hands it off to Hunter. Left side. Hit at the 48. And tried to push the ball up near the first down at the 49. I don't know if he got it. I think he's just short, Dave. I think he's about a half yard short. High formation. Robinson under center. Bryant Ward is the fullback. Kendall Hunter the tailback. Quarterback sneak, Robinson straight ahead, got the first down. The Cowboys had to move a lot of muscle in there, about 600 pounds of Baylor beef in the interior. Out of the eye, 
Des Bryant split right. Demarcus Connor to the left. Zach takes a snap, fakes a handoff, drops back, sets up, throws near side. The pass is caught by Des Bryant, and Bryant is wrestled out of bounds at the 35-yard line of Baylor. Zach takes a snap, hands it off to Hunter. Big hole up the middle to the 30. Veers off to his right to the 27 and is wrestled down from behind at the Baylor 26 on the left hash mark. And Zach is in the shotgun for a second down and two from the Baylor 26. Zach takes a snap, drops back, quick throw near side, leaping catch met by Des Bryant. Breaks a tackle at the 20 and is dropped at the 19 of Baylor. Seven yard gain on the play and Antarius Bryan, the corner, made the stop for Baylor, but it's a first down for Oklahoma State from the Baylor 19. And let's go down to Robert Allen. Just gonna mention, you've got a big corner in Bryant. He is very athletic. And Dez, this is a good matchup. Guys, keep an eye on this because Bryant is as big and physical on defense as Bryant is on off, or as Dez is on offense. First and 10 Cowboys from the Baylor 19. Josh Cooper is into the game, replacing Des Bryant. He split out right. On first and 10, hand off to Kendall Hunter up the middle. Room to run to the 15, and Hunter dropped at the 13-yard line after six yards. Second down and four, Oklahoma State from the Baylor 13. Des Bryant is now split out right, back in the game. Bro Robinson under center, gets a snap, fakes a handoff, rolls out right. He can run it to the 10 and chased out of bounds on the right sideline near a first down at the Baylor eight yard line. That was a run pass option for Zach Robinson. The receivers were covered, so Zach took off and he gained four yards and a Cowboy first down before safety Jake Lamar chased him out of bounds. We're in this spot of the field where you need to go ahead and punch this in. Quick snap, hand off to Tostin, right side to the five and he barrels his way through a tackle down to the Baylor four. Des Bryant split left, Demarcus Connor right, second to goal from the four, hand off to Tostin, right side, pushes the pile into the end zone. Pistols firing, touchdown Oklahoma State, Keith Tostin. It's a good sign, a good sign, and you run behind that strength, and Tostin just finds enough daylight where he can go ahead and push it in over the goal line. Cowboys go 61 yards in 11 plays, and Dan Bailey on for the point after. Try to give the Cowboys a lead. Snap back, ball down, the kick is on the way, and it's good. Robinson takes the snap, makes a handoff, pumps, throws it deep down the right side for Des Bryant, and he makes the catch in the end zone. Pistols firing, touchdown Oklahoma State, Des Bryant. So Oklahoma State, who scored on its last possession, mark, marching 65 yards, will have it first and 10 from their own 38. Toaston to Zach Robinson's left. Zach is in the shotgun with Bo Bowling and Des Bryant split left and Demarcus Connor to the right. And Toaston gets a handoff, running off right guard to the 40. Breaks a tackle at the 43, crashes to another at the 45, and he pushes the pile all the way up to the Cowboy 48. Keith Toaston would not be denied. Last week, Toaston had only three carries for four yards. Today, he's already reached the end zone in that terrific run. Gained 10 yards and a Cowboy first down from the OSU 48. Brady Bond, the big right tackle, just shoved his man flat onto the turf to help open a hole there. Jeremy Broadway split to the left with Bo Bowling, Demarcus Connor, rather Des Bryant split right. First and 10, Oklahoma State from its own 48. Zach Robinson takes a snap, runs the option left, pitches it to Toasted. Left side to midfield and upended and dropped in Baylor territory at about the 46. Robinson looks to the sideline to get the play. Keith Toasted to his left. Second and four. Zach hands it off to Toasted up the middle to the 40. First down and tackled at the Baylor 37. Jordan Lake with another tackle, but Toasted gained nine yards and a Cowboy first down. And Robinson takes a snap, fakes a handoff, pumps, throws it deep down the right side for Des Bryant, and he makes the catch in the end zone! Pistols firing, touchdown Oklahoma State, Des Bryant!
That's what the ability to run the football can do for you in the passing game. The play action working beautifully. Des going out and up. If that corner or that safety, whoever's out there, takes a peek in the backfield and leans one way, that's one way too many as far as being able to break that up. Des is wide open. And that ball was underthrown. He had to fight for it at the goal line. Dan Bailey on for the point after. Snap back, ball down. The kick is on the way, and it's good. So touchdowns in two consecutive possessions for number eight, Oklahoma State. And the Cowboys now lead Baylor 14 to 6, with 12-14 left to play in the first half. We'll pause. This is a Cowboy Network. Fourteen to six, Oklahoma State on top, and the Cowboys back on offense. They've scored on their last two possessions. First and ten, OSU from its own 19. Zach Robinson takes a shotgun snap, hands it off to Hunter on a draw play, off right guard to the 23, and tackled from behind at the Baylor, rather at the Oklahoma State 25. Gain of six, Joe Pavelic, the inside linebacker, made the stop. Second down and four, coming up for the Cowboys from the OSU 25. Pretty good job by the. Offensive line of the Cowboys right there, and Hunter had some room on the right side. Second down and four, Oklahoma State from its own 25. Bo Bowling and Jeremy Broadway split left, and Des Bryant to the right. Des had a TD reception a couple of minutes ago, and Zach back to pass, finds Des, throws it to the right side, makes a catch, right sideline, breaks a tackle at the 32, and scoots up the right sideline before being knocked out of bounds at the 37-yard line of Oklahoma State, and I think we'll have a face mask penalty against the Bears. Well, you heard the Cowboy fans go crazy about it. That's the first penalty against Baylor. Is that right? Yeah, I believe you're right. First foul. Second. Second. Number Sorry. two. On the defense. 15-yard penalty, and it's an end of the run. Automatic first down. To the Bear 47. Robinson in the shotgun. Des Bryant split left. Jeremy Broadway right. Hunter in a one-back set, shifting over to Zach's right. And Zach takes a snap, fakes a handoff, fires it over the middle, incomplete. It was tipped. And then it hit Brandon Pettigrew right in the hands, and he dropped it. Hard to catch that ball off a tip, especially when you haven't played in a month. Incomplete pass. It'll be second down and 10 for Baylor, rather for Oklahoma State from the Baylor 47. Baylor gave him a different look in the secondary that time. A couple of safeties back deep. Pavelic dropping back in there. And Zach did not exactly look off Pettigrew that time. 9.44 left in the second quarter. Oklahoma State 14, Baylor 6. And OSU on the move, second and 10 from the Baylor 47. Robinson takes a snap, runs the option. Pitches it to Hunter with blockers in front. Left side of the 45 and spun down at the Baylor 41-yard line. Three guys had covered up Zach Robinson before he made the pitch. And Cowboys go to an empty backfield and five wide receivers, three to the right, two to the left. Zach Robinson in the shotgun on third and a long four from the Baylor 42. Zach takes a snap, drops back, he'll run it. Straight ahead to the 40, lowers his shoulder and barrels his way down to the first down as he falls forward to the Baylor 36. Antonio Jones made the stop and Robinson had to make a cutback and go to his left and then run through a tackle to pick up the six yard gain and a Cowboy first down. He doesn't get enough credit for, it's not exactly a stiff arm, but he uses that off arm, that left arm to shove tacklers away and that helped him on that play. Baylor had a pretty good defense called for that play, John. Two receivers to the right. Des Bryant split alone to the left. I formation now with Bryant Ward at fullback and Kendall Hunter at tailback. First and 10 from the Baylor 36. Zach takes a snap, hands it off to Hunter. Makes a cut back to his left, 35, spins at the 30, and is drugged down from behind at the 30-yard line. I formation again with single wide receivers left and right. Second and four, Oklahoma State from the Baylor 30. Robinson, quick drop, pumps, now throws it deep down the left side for Des Bryant, and it's incomplete, he overthrew him. And Bryant was wide open and was ready to haul in his second TD catch of the day. Incomplete pass, it'll be third down and four for Oklahoma State from the Baylor 30. Let's go down to Robert Allen. Communication on the fly, guys, that was not the design play. You saw Zach and you can see the eye contact. 
And then that's when, you know, he pump faked, and that's when Bryant took off, when Dez took off. Just uh, couldn't get it done. Too, over, too overthrown. Three receivers right, one left, and thank you, Robert. Third down and four, Oklahoma State from the Baylor 30. Hunter in a one-back set to Robinson's right as he takes a shotgun snap. Hands it off on a counter to Hunter. Left side, first down, 25 to the left sideline to the 23 and tackled at the Baylor 22-yard line. Robinson takes a snap, hands it off to Hunter. Right side to the 20, cuts back to the 18 and is tackled at the Baylor 17, four yards on the play. Jordan Lake made the stop for Baylor and Kendall Hunter now with 12 carries for 48 yards. Came into the game needing 138 yards to reach 1,000 on the year. Dave DeMarcus Connor, a receiver out there, textbook on the safety, Jeremy Williams. He had him blocked so far out of the play. Williams, even if he'd been able to get free, would not have been close to making a play. Second down, we'll call it seven for Oklahoma State from the Baylor 18-yard line. Two receivers left, Damian Davis and DeMarcus Connor. Zach takes a shotgun snap, runs the option left, fakes, now keeps it, 15 to the 10, first down, and tackled at the eight-yard line. Zach Robinson faked the pitch, the defender bit, then Zach veered back toward the center of the field and gained eight yards, and a Cowboy first and goal from the Baylor nine-yard line. Not only did he fake the pitch, he escaped the tackle of the man who still had him as the assignment. Quick snap, hand off to Kendall Hunter, and he trips over his own man's foot and falls down at the line of scrimmage, running on the left side at the Baylor nine. It'll be second and goal for Oklahoma State from there. 6-10 left in the second. Oklahoma State 14, Baylor 6, and the Cowboys trying to add to their lead. Brandon Pettigrew back in there, Dave, on the left side. Along the same side as Des Bryant at the moment. Three receivers right, Bryant to the left. Robinson in the shotgun, empty backfield. Second and goal from the Baylor nine. Robinson takes the snap, drops back, sets up, floats it toward the end zone, and a leaping catch is made by Des Bryant. Pistols firing, touchdown Oklahoma State, the amazing Des Bryant. That's number 11 receiving on the year, number 13 overall for Des Bryant. And he just outfought Antarius Bryant. Robert had detailed the big physical corner, Bryant, at 6'1", 190 against Bryant. This time, T at the end stands for touchdown. Dan Bailey on for the point after. Snap back, ball down, kick on the way, and it's good. Keith Toasted is back into the game at tailback. He's lined up behind Zach Robinson, who's under center now. Brandon Pettigrew, the tight end, a wing to the right. Now he shifts back in motion to the left side, where he's lined up on the line of scrimmage. First and 10, Oklahoma State from the Baylor 47. It's a handoff to Toasted, left side. Turns the corner, 45, still in his feet to the 40. And he delivers a blow to the tackler before being knocked out of bounds at the Baylor 39. And Terrius Bryant knocked him out of bounds, but to be honest, Tostin ran through him as much as Bryant delivered the bow to, blow to Keith. Eight yard gain, second and two. Cowboys quickly up to the line. Zach takes a shotgun snap, hands it off to Tostin. Left side 35, first down to the 31. And he has stopped right at the 31 yard line. Gain of seven, first down Oklahoma State. We give Kendall Hunter a lot of credit for being shifty and making guys miss. Right there, Leon Freeman, the defensive end, had Tostin right in front of him. Tostin gave him a little shake and bake move and went right around him. And Freeman never touched him. Bo Johnson came in initially at tailback, and now Kendall Hunter has run out there. The Cowboys have a first and 10 from the Baylor 32, leading 21 to 6 with four minutes and two seconds left to play in the second quarter. Robinson under center, takes a snap, hands it off to Hunter. Bounces around, now running on the left side to the 30 and smothered and tackled. Well, there's another fly. Now there's another late fly. Tackled at the 30-yard line after a one-yard gain, and what's this all about? Well, there's a lot of extra stuff, a late hit coming in on top of the pile once Hunter was down. And I think this is as much to clean some of this stuff up as anything else. Action play, personal foul, number 76 on the offense. 
335 left to play in the second. The Cowboys have scored on three consecutive offensive possessions. They're in a bind here, though, with this second and 24. Robinson takes a shotgun snap, back to pass, sets up, throws it deep down the right side, and it's overthrown, intended for Des Bryant, incomplete. Bryant was at about the 10. The ball landed at the 5. Princeton Hill in coverage. It'll be third down and 24 for Oklahoma State. Now you'd like to at least get the ball up into field goal range for Dan Bailey or get yourself into a position where on fourth down, maybe you consider going for it. They'll face a third and 24 now. Zach under a little bit of pressure that time. Kendall Hunter stayed in to try to help pick up one of the guys getting in there. I think it was Jason Lamb. Kendall Hunter to the right of Zach Robinson, who's in the shotgun. Des Bryant split right. Demarcus Connor to the left. Now Hunter shifts over to Zach's left, and now the snap comes. They're going to get called for delay a game. All right, snap. Delay a game. Offense. Five yard penalty. Still third down. From midfield. Blake locked down to four. Robinson gets the play, takes a shotgun snap, fakes a handoff, drops back, scrambles. Now he'll run it. Bearing off to his right, 45, 40, 35, 30. Makes a cut and slides down, shy of the first down, but all the way down to the Baylor 27. Very he smart. He back 23 of the yards, John. Pardon me there, Dave. Very smart by Zach, though. You know you got some headhunters in that secondary, just big hitters. Jordan Lake being the biggest one there. You want you got to preserve yourself. Now, what do you do? It's fourth and six. They may go for it. Dan Bailey has never made a field goal longer than 28 yards, so they may just go for it on fourth and six from the Baylor 27. Two receivers left, one right. Cowboys up 21 to six. Baylor shows blitz. Robinson takes the shotgun snap. Flag down. Zach throws it toward the end zone for Damian Davis, and he dropped it incomplete. Oh, wow. And, and the defender never turned around. Yeah, free play. He'll be offsides, but the defender never turned around. Maybe you get two flags. You might rather have that one in the oh, end Oh, you would. That's an automatic first down on the pass interference. Oh. Offsides. Number 90. On the defense. Five-yard penalty. Result of penalty. First down. Robinson under center. Fourth and one. Demarcus Conner goes in motion to the right side. And Robinson runs the option, keeps it. First down to the 20, breaks a tackle and dives inside the 15, down to the Baylor 14. Oklahoma State just got out of a third and 29 hole, and they'll have a first and 10 from the Baylor 14. You want options on fourth and short? First and 10, Cowboys from the Baylor 14. Hand off to Tostin up the middle. Hit from behind, breaks that tackle, and then is hit and dropped for Oh, after a two-yard gain down to the Baylor 12. It'll be second down and eight. Earl Patton, the reserve linebacker, made the tackle for Baylor. Two minutes left to play in the first half. Oklahoma State 21, Baylor 6. Got a lot of personnel shifting going on right here. Pettigrew comes off. Is that Newman coming off? And you've got three receivers left and one right. Do the Cowboys have 11 players out there? I think they only have 10. 10. They have to call the timeout. Yeah, Zach Robinson will call timeout. Hunter came off the field confused. He was initially lined up with a group timeout. of three receivers Hold to the left. Second. He would have been the fourth. 30 seconds. He timeout. came off. 30 Start seconds. counting guys. No need to play 10 against 11. Second down, and we'll call it nine for Oklahoma State from the Baylor 13. The Cowboys have two timeouts left. Minute 42 left in the second. Robinson hands it off to Hunter. Left side 10. Bounces to the outside at the eight and is tackled from behind at the Baylor seven. Six yards for Kendall Hunter before strong safety Jake Lamar made the stop. We'll call it third down and three for Oklahoma State. Had Hunter not hesitated and perhaps accelerated, he may have been able to get the necessary yardage for a first down. Third down and three, Cowboys from the Baylor seven. Robinson under center, Kendall Hunter in a one-back set. Minute five left to play in the second. Oklahoma State 21, Baylor six. Robinson takes a snap, hands it off to Hunter. Up the middle to the five, lowers his head and bullies his way down near a first down. He had to push the tackler 
toward the Baylor goal line to get there, and I think he has enough. Looks like they'll spot him down at the Baylor three and a half, and if that's the case, it'll be a first and goal for Oklahoma State. It is. It is. And now you're under a minute. You control things. Robinson, quarterback sneak off left guard. He dives down to the Baylor one. Gained about two. Down to 47 seconds left. The Cowboys do have two timeouts left. Second and goal coming up. The Cowboys bring in new personnel, including what we'd call their behemoth package is Trent Perkins. An offensive tackle comes into the game, and he's lined up at left tackle. Second and goal from the one. Down to 27 seconds left. High formation. Robinson under center. Takes a snap. Hands it off to Toasted right side. Breaks a tackle at the goal line and gets into the end zone. Just barely. Pistols firing. Touchdown, Oklahoma State. Keith Toasted. Boy, he just mashed down the field on him. You come out of that third and 29. Zach Robinson's feet making a huge difference on this drive. You convert a fourth down. And right, then you just say, look, you're going to line up and stop the run, or you're going to have to stop this run. And they haven't been able to do it here in the second quarter. Four straight possessions with a touchdown for Oklahoma State after the Cowboys fell behind early 6-0. Extra point by Dan Bailey. Snap back. The ball is down. The kick is on the way. And it's good. Zach takes a snap, fakes a handoff, drops back to pass, sets up, throws it deep down the near side for Des Bryant, and he makes the catch inside the 20 and wrestled down from behind at the Baylor 12-yard line on the left sideline. A spinning catch by Bryant and another amazing play by the Cowboys sophomore. One-on-one, -on -one. if Baylor insists on doing that, the Cowboys have a tremendous advantage at that position. And that was Chris Burke trying to defend at that time. Bryant turned at the last moment to haul in the catch, adjusting to the ball in the air. It's a 53-yard gain. First and 10, Oklahoma State now from the Baylor 13-yard line. Cowboys up 28-6. Robinson hands it off to Hunter, trying to turn a corner right side, hesitates at the 10, and is tackled at the 9, a three-yard gain. And Terrius Bryan, the corner, made the stop for Baylor. Let's pause 10 seconds for station identification on the Cowboy Network. Dave Huntsiker, John Holcomb, Robert Allen, our entire Cowboy Network crew with you from Boone Pickett Stadium. Oklahoma State has a second and seven from the Baylor nine. The Cowboys lead 28 to six, trying to add to the lead. Des Bryant is out for the moment. Wonder if he was shaken up on that long catch as Robinson gets a shotgun snap, keeps it running straight ahead, and he gains maybe a yard down to the Baylor eight. James Hardman and Earl Patton team up to make the stop. It'll be third and six for the Cowboys from the Baylor eight yard line. 9.46 left in the third. It's Oklahoma State 28, Baylor six. Well, you wonder about that one. It almost looked like that might not have been the original play they wanted to run, but they'll do that occasionally with Zach. Josh Cooper split left. Damian Davis and Demarcus Connor to the right, so Des Bryant is still out. Kendall Hunter in a one-back set to Zach Robinson's right. Play clock at three, third and seven from the eight. Hand off on a draw play to Hunter. Up the middle to the five, crashes through a tackler at the three, and is stopped near the first down marker at the two-yard line of Baylor. Uh, that's going to be close. That's going to be really close. I, I, at first glance, it looks like he's just short. How many times have you seen a team run a draw in that part of the field? Not and have it, it, it work. That's. Well, we may have a measurement here. They'll bring the chains from the far side of the field. The ball is resting basically with the tip of where the extra point attempt is spotted. That gives you an image where that line, that long line is. They pull the chains good and tight. What do we have? Oh. First and goal. 
by that much. Maybe by an inch or something. Let's go down to Robert. Robert. Yeah, there, there's nothing wrong with this. Okay. I mean, the, the entire medical team is watching the ball game. Nobody's okay. working on anybody right <laughs> now. I, I've been up and down. Well, we were checking. Eddie Neuendorf was quick to alert us that Dez was out, and he did fall to the ground hard. So he just wanted to make sure everybody knew he wasn't out there for whatever reason it might be. Now, that's Brian snap, ball start, 86 on the offense, five yard penalty, still first down. After the illegal procedure penalty, high formation with two tight ends. Zach Robinson takes a snap, hands it off the toast, an off right guard to the five, and he squirts down to about the Baylor three and a half. It'll be second and goal as Earl Patton, the linebacker for Baylor, made the stop. By the way, the Oklahoma tourism destination of the game is the Chickasaw National Recreation Area. I was right. Eddie was wrong. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Robert was wrong, too. Well, kudos. On second and goal, a handoff to Tostin. He's hitting the backfield and manages to get maybe back to the line of scrimmage. Jordan Lake, the free safety, made the stop for Baylor. It'll be third and goal for Oklahoma State. From the Baylor four with seven minutes and 50 seconds left in the third, Oklahoma State with a 28-6 lead over Baylor. This drive started in Baylor territory back at the Bear 36 after the Bears fumbled the football, which Ricky Price recovered. Long completion to Des Bryant has set the stage, and now it's third and goal for OSU from the Baylor four. Des Bryant, Demarcus Connor split left. Keith Tostin in a one-back set to Zach's left. Third and goal. Robinson takes a snap, runs the option, pitches it to Tostin on the left side, and he is tackled at the two-yard line, two yards shy of the end zone by Earl Patton. And the field goal team is going to come on for the Cowboys. Build back some confidence here with Dan Bailey after yes. that miss last week. Well, Bailey missed that 25-yarder up at Columbia last Saturday. And this will be a 20-yard attempt from the left hash mark. He'll have to cut it. That is, work it from left to right. Matt Bodge will hold. Snap back, ball down. The kick is on the way. It's high and long, and it's good. 6.39 left in the third. Oklahoma State has expanded its lead to 31-6 over Baylor. You want to keep building. Split backs. Griffin in the shotgun gets a snap. Fakes a handoff. Rolls out right. Under pressure. And he's pushed out of bounds for a three-yard loss on the right side. Back at the 20-yard line. Kansas State at Colorado. Missouri at Texas will both be played tonight. Second and 13, Baylor from its own 20. Jacoby Jones in a one-back set. Robert Griffin under center takes a snap. Blitz coming. Sets up. Now hit in the backfield and sacked for a five-yard loss back at the 15-yard line by Ricky Price, who was coming on a safety blitz. Griffin was under pressure the whole way. He pulled it down, did not have a lane. The Cowboys did a great job of collapsing the pocket without leaving him a lane to get out. So it's third down and 18 yards to go for Baylor from its own 15. Baylor is one for six on third down. Three receivers left, two to the right. Griffin in the shotgun, empty backfield. Three down linemen for the Cowboys, six defensive backs, and Griffin back to pass, flushed, scrambling straight ahead, hit from behind and tackled at the 17-yard line. Hugo Chanasa got him after just a two-yard gain. It's fourth and long, and Baylor will punt again. Zach Robinson in the shotgun. Gets a snap on first and 10, makes a handoff, throws over the middle. The pass is caught by Brandon Pettigrew at midfield and tackled in Baylor territory at the Bear 46-yard line. You knew that was coming. You, you had to get the big man involved in it again. You needed to look his way at some point, and that's that right down the seam. He's wide open. Nice grab. 
Brandon Pettigrew, who's missed the last three games with an ankle injury, gets that catch for 22 yards, and that's his first catch since the second game of the season against the University of Houston, his 11th on the year. For the big tight end, 6'6", 260 pounds. First and 10, Oklahoma State from the Baylor 46. Draw play handoff to Hunter up the middle to the Bear 45 and dropped at the Baylor 43. Three yards on the play. Joe Demarcus Connor, Damian Davis split left. Des Bryant to the right. Robinson takes a shotgun snap, hands it off to Hunter. Big hole up the middle, 35. Makes a cut to his right to the 30 and stumbles down at the Baylor 38. And if he gets to the outside on the right side, I think he's gone. 15 yard gain, first down Oklahoma State from the Baylor 28. Uh, you look at the replay, Trenton Hill, I think, is the one who comes across it. How does Kendall Hunter see him? Out of the corner, he's got to be looking through his right ear hole to even see him coming. <laughs> and just dodges sideways, gets past him. 21 carries for 88 yards for Kendall Hunter. First and 10, Oklahoma State from the Baylor 28. Hunter lined up to the right of Zach Robinson, who's in the shotgun. Zach takes the snap, drops back, quick throw near side, caught by Bryant, hit, but he drags a tackle inside the 20 and down to the 19-yard line. And Terrius Bryant, who's a pretty big corner at 6'1", 190, hit him at the bare 23, and then Bryant just carried him on his back for four additional yards down to the Baylor 19 and a half. It'll be second and one. You ever seen the world's strongest man competition where they're pulling the trucks? Yeah. That's kind of what he looked like there. On second and one, Robinson runs the bootleg. Room to run, right side to the 15, down to the 10, and tackled from behind at the Baylor nine and a half. Antonio Jones made the stop, but Zach Robinson gained 10 yards, and a Cowboy first and goal, I believe. They'll mark him down at the Baylor 10. He had Jamal Mosley, the freshman tight end, out there and then directed Jamal when he decided to run, directed Jamal to go take out the safety, Jeremy Williams. And Mosley, he's coachable. He went out and did it. Oklahoma State 31, Baylor 6. And the Cowboys have a first and goal from the Baylor 10. Two minutes and 17 seconds left in the third quarter here in Boone Pickens Stadium in Stillwater. The Cowboys moving from right to left. Out of the eye. Robinson hands it off to Hunter. Up the middle. Hit at the line of scrimmage and stop for no gain. Zach takes the snap. Hands it off to Hunter. Off right guard. Room to run to the 6. And he falls backward down at the Baylor five and a half. Joe Pavelic made the stop again. Third and goal coming up for Oklahoma State from the Baylor five and a half. With a minute 13 left in the third, Oklahoma State on top 31 to six over Baylor. You mentioned Dez's numbers, and let's not forget he had a touchdown on a punt return called back too. Yeah. Dez Bryant split right, Demarcus Connor left. High formation, Pettigrew the tight end left. That's third and goal for Oklahoma State from the Baylor five and a half. Less than a minute to play in the third. Robinson takes a snap, runs the option left, cuts back, slips, and manages to advance the ball a yard down the field to the Baylor four. Well, as Zach made his cut back toward the center of the field, he slipped, managed to stay on his feet, but gained only a yard. Now the field goal team is back out for the Cowboys. And the play clock and the time on the third quarter clock are about exact, so they'll probably need to run this play, and they'll be kicking into the shadowed portion of Boone Pickens Stadium, the west end zone. From right to left, this is a 21-yard field goal attempt for Dan Bailey. He's already made one from 20. Low snap, ball down, knuckleball kick on the way, and it's good.